Okay, since I've posted uh, installation videos, the by far the number one comment and concern is about clearances. Now, um, a lot of people asking why the pump is so close to the wall and saying there's not sufficient clearance and airflow. Now, the air is clearly being sucked in and we've got quite a large opening over here. Now, Valent says we need 200 mil of clearance. So we've got 290 mil of clearance as well as a clear opening down the side. So the fan is on this side and it's clearly pulling from down the side of the house. Now the other question was, they said uh, it's got to be a hundred mil of clearance. Well, <laughs> let's uh, let's not take this to extreme, shall we? Let's, uh, let's have a look. As you can see, we are almost dead on one meter. And uh, yes, I did get planning permission for this heat pump installation. And another video maybe to cover that in depth. Now, over this side, where they said also we didn't have clearance. See, we've got 110 mil. Now, Valent say they want 100 mil on the left-hand side, and they want 500 mil on the right-hand side. This isn't for airflow reasons. I did contact Valent and ask them specifically, why do you want 500 mil on the right and only 100 mil on the left? And their reasoning was service access is really the key thing. So I may come to regret the decision to push this right into the corner. So far, a few of the comments were saying, you're gonna suffer a terrible cop and it's all way too close and everything else. I hope this goes to demonstrate that we've got plenty of clearance back here. Um, nearly 300 mil behind it and as I say it's sucking air from here around the corner of the house and bringing it in. Um, it, the, uh, we are on the flexi hoses so it is possible to, um, to some extent to shift it without disconnecting it and draining down the system for servicing. Um, if it does become a real hassle when we, in a year's time, when we need a service and we need to get that right hand cover off, then of course I will be more than happy for us to just relocate it. Um, whether that is uh, just shifting it over to the left by another 400 mil, which of course, if we have a quick look, will still will still be giving me a walkway down the side anyway and potentially will give us better efficiencies as well because the airflow will be even better sucking in from the dead side of the house the house where we never go and no one ever sees but um, potentially that may be something to uh, bear in mind for the future but uh, right now it is functioning okay efficiency is good it's just ticking along probably can't even hear that maybe you can I don't know how sensitive the microphone is in this phone for for winds but it's just uh, the target flow temperature is about 30 degrees at the moment so not exactly blasting it for domestic hot water but it's absolutely silent all I can hear is the uh, road traffic so I hope that explains clearances and site and location and um, yeah, maybe if I could do it again, uh, I would have taken some of your comments uh, into account and maybe we would have just pushed it further over to the left and just narrowed our walkway down there a little bit. But I also kind of like the fact that it is tucked in just perfectly with the lines of the house. Um, doesn't protrude from the front and so we don't have to worry about the R290 clearances to these doors because the pump is set back. Um, if the pump was further towards me or further out here then we'd be too close to these French doors for R290 clearances and um, this window is a non-opening window so that's not an issue as well. Anyway, uh, that's all from me on the clearance issue. Hope that uh, kind of explains some of the comments.